Good morning, friends. So today, we're hopefully gonna do a little vlog. Uh, I am parked outside of a Sephora. So the Sephora savings event started on Friday. I'm filming on Monday. Anyone else can't use the Sephora website? Like, I understood Friday morning that it was like really laggy and like sometimes I would click something and then I would get like an error page and it was like, sorry, we're experiencing like high traffic volume. Whatever, that's fine. Like, I'm not upset about it. But the Friday night it was still happening and I was like, all right. Saturday, I checked in the morning before I left and it was still, like I couldn't click on an actual product. Like I could type something into the search bar, but then when I tried to click it to like, you know, pick a shade, whatever, nothing would happen. I'm like, all right. And then I even tried on Sunday and I still couldn't get the site to work. And I was like, this is insane. So I'm just now outside of a Sephora store. I don't know if they're gonna have everything that I want, but I figured I could at least go in see what they have, see if there's anything that I want to pick up. There goes an airplane. So I'm at Town Square in Las Vegas, which is like right next to the airport, so there's always a ton of planes. But I'm at the Town Square in Las Vegas. I was gonna do the shops at Palazzo, but honestly, that place was freaking so packed. Um, I went this morning to a little donut shop to do some content for them, so I'm kind of like dressed up for the morning, but it was cute, and I figured Town Square is close enough, and we're gonna go see what they have. There's just like a handful of things that I would like to grab. I feel like they're not gonna have the Lawless Powder in store, but maybe they'll have some of the house labs. Like I wanted to try the concealer. Um, so yeah, we'll just we'll just see what they have and see if we can do any shopping. I have a couple videos up on like recommendations, top picks, but now we will see what they have in store. So let's go.
Okay, well that's that's an itty bitty Sephora haul. Okay, um, I'm mostly sad because they had a house labs area, but it was under like like a cloak. What? <laughs> I really, really wanted that concealer. But that's okay. Um, yeah, so I ended up just getting a couple things, so I'll just let me just do a little haul for you right now. Um you know the when you go to check out and there's all the extras they always get me but I am glad I saw this because I do need a new dry shampoo so I just got the one from I'm trying to do a haul and this person next to me is trying to parallel park like let's get it together oh so I just got one of these it's bigger like I have like a really small one at home but I'm gonna check a bag to Austin Listen, I'm going for a week. Like, I'm going to check a bag, okay? Um, so, I'll check a bag to Austin. So, I'm just going to throw this in my bag. But I really do like this dry shampoo. I I got two lip balms. <clears throat> I got four products and half of them were lip balms. I've, I feel some type of way. But I want both of these. One is a repurchase and one I haven't tried but everyone talks about. So I got the Glossier Coconut Balm.com. Now I had this many moons ago and I know people have said that it's been reformulated. So I wanted to test it out for science. You know, see how I like it, see what's going on. But this was just one, I'm sorry, the sun is like, the sun's very intense. But this was one of my favorites years ago. I got all my girlfriends hooked on it. It's just a clear lip balm and is, it was like one of those that I could just put on in the morning and it would just stay on and it would hydrate my lips and it was like thick and moisturizing and I loved it. So I wanted to get another one and now that glo oh, I didn't get an eyeliner. It's okay. I have plenty of eyeliners. Samantha, don't panic. You have, you have eyeliners. Uh, so <laughs> now that Glossier is being sold at Sephora, I was like, I might as well grab it. I don't know where I put the box. And then, okay, I've mentioned the Summer Fridays lip balm because so many people talk about it. And I put it in my $1,000 Sephora card. I'm pretty sure I put the Glossier in there as well. Airplane! I'm like a child watching the airplanes. I can't even explain. Like, I get so excited every time an airplane goes by. I'm like, ah! Am I going to be able to get out? These people are, like, really close to me. Okay, okay. But, yeah, we got the Summer Fridays lip balm. I did some swatches. I was trying to decide between vanilla beige or brown sugar. I went with brown sugar. Honestly, I love to put a little brown sugar syrup in my iced chais. So we got the brown sugar. I don't know. I, you're probably not going to see anything because of the lighting, but I did just like a little swatch. I liked it a little bit more than vanilla beige, which I also should have wiped off these swatches because I'm probably going to get them everywhere. But I'm really excited to try this out because everyone talks about it. So I finally feel like I'm part of the it crowd. So two lip balms. <clears throat> they did have a Lawless Beauty section, but they didn't really have much. Like usually Lawless is just like on an end cap. So that's why I was like, I don't think that they're gonna have the powder, you know, especially with all the different shades. They had the glosses, they had some palettes, they had some skincare, but they didn't have um, the powder, but they did have the new Huda Beauty powder. So I talked about this in a recent new makeup releases video and I said that I did wanna try it because so many people love the loose powder. I am more of a pressed powder girl, like the Dior Powder No Powder than the Lawless Powder. Those are both pressed. I'm just more into pressed right now. So I wanted to pick it up. I did swatch a couple of different shades. I wasn't sure which one was gonna be the best. I ended up going with Pound Cake. I feel like Pound Cake is what I also hear the most amount of people talking about. So I decided I was going back and forth between this and cupcake, but I was worried the cupcake would be a little bit too pink because I do want to use this like all over my face. So I don't know. I'm curious to try it out though because you guys know Lawless is like what's reigning supreme for me right now, but I figure we can give this a try. This is the Easy Bake and Snatch powder. So got a little pound cake action. So we're going to try this. So airplane. Welcome to my city. Have fun. Make smart choices. No one ever makes smart choices here. I'm gonna make smart choices, y'all. Um, so that was just my little four piece Sephora haul. So I am gonna head home and see if the website is working yet. I really do want the House Labs concealer. I feel like there was a couple other things that like I really wanted to get. Um, so I'm gonna see if the Sephora site's working. And then honestly, I'm probably just gonna ship it to Angie's. Like if there is things that I want. I'm just going to ship it to Angie's and I can film like a little haul there. I can film like Angie reacting to my haul or something. I don't know. 
we'll film something but as long as i can get what i want online i'm just that's going to be my plan so thanks for coming along it was a pretty small haul but you got to see some of the store i'm just going to finish drinking my matcha again i went to donut eek this morning it's at the palazzo like the grand canal shops um there's a big love sign on the first floor and right next to it is this super cute donut shop it's so instagrammable but also the donuts are amazing you get a free donut on your birthday so if you're coming for your birthday take all your girlfriends stop in at donut teak because it was so cute the owner is so nice her story of why she started is so admirable i'm going to be posting on instagram about it and the cupcakes were bomb there's a birthday cupcake there's like a blueberry cupcake that was so good there's a honey truffle they have truffle that they put infused in their honey and then put it on a donut the creativity of people like i cannot i would never think to do any of these things but it was super good and i got a little matcha so i'm gonna drink this and head home and thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the vlog I'll see you in the next one.